is alright with me. DT is alright. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm Roy. This is W Dog. The Warn Dogs. This is V8. Calvinator. Uh, and Ooh. we thought we'd better just check in because it's obviously it's all open. It looks great. And uh, yeah, we just wanted to check into. Sensational. Lots of lots of new features on there. There is. Yeah. Um, on the thing. Lots of pretty colours. Mm, colours. Really it's just beautiful. fantastic. Picture of Hodgie at the top of it. Oh, yeah, yeah. He, he is there, the man but, this year, isn't he? He is the man. I'll tell you what. If you wanted to talk to any person that loves their DT more than anyone, that would be Hodgie. Hell yeah, yeah. yeah right. Righto, unbelievably, we've been um, lucky enough to catch Hodgie here again for um, our second interview with him, so welcome to DT Talk, Hodgie. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it again. Um, firstly, how did you finish up last year? After grand final. Um, very sorry, drunk. Yeah. <laughs> very drunk. <laughs> very drunk. Yeah. Um, yeah, finished up very well. Um, yeah, we had a good year last year. Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, we had a good year. 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 Yeah, we had a Oh, yeah, did you? So, so you lost so the more important grand final. But yes, yeah, I'll uh, after revenge this year, don't remember that. Yeah, yeah, good point. Good Just boy. a quick question I've got as well, jumping on that. Now, if you were to get two points for a beer and say three points for a bourbon or something like that, how many points did you have after the grand final? <laughs> don't drink bourbon, but um, no, we were pretty smart after our finals. Yeah. Uh, it was pretty mature. Orders. It's all in moderation. So, I'm not going to say that on camera, we're very good boys. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> DT opened up very recently and I'm just sure you've already jumped on and been having a look at your team. How are you going with that? Have you got a few locked in already? It's been hard. It's been hard this year. I've still got, got to have Mitch in there. He's, uh, every year I've played, he's been in there mainly my skip, but he's pretty consistent. So there's a few. Juddy, um, very good point scorer. Yeah, him. And, also, rise, and also, I might be a little bit biased, but I can run. Ruffy's uh, oh. he's always got him in there, just sitting in the back pocket that they had him last year. And yeah, good idea last year. Too. I think he might only be a forward now because of mm, last year. I'll be able to squeeze him. Just now, now Ruffy might be a bit of a Ruffy, <laughs> but <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. But uh, any other maybe other Hawks guys that are sort of on the upper bit, you reckon? Yeah, look, uh, so I think I said this last year. Bo Mustard, he uh, did his knee. Um, nice. I had him in my team until he, until he hurt himself. He uh, he's fine this stage. He's uh, looking, he's consistently training and yep. uh, looking yeah. very good. So, so can we get the Hodgie guarantee that he'll be in round one for us. Mate, there's no guarantee. <laughs> but, uh, but like, he'll be, uh, he'll be definitely in my team. So. Um, awesome. Now, Hodge, I remember last year you said you didn't have yourself in uh, in your own team. Now, in the prospectus this year, this is what it says about you. He won the Hawks of Flag, so in the main GF. So if you're picking no, up no, this you're, year, you're reading Jewies. That's true. That's true. That's true. <laughs> oh, you had a fair part in it, mate. And it says, if you pick him up this year, maybe he'll win you the flag. So maybe oh. that's all you're missing in D2, mate. Back no, yourself. Mate. Not a hope. Not a hope? No, there's plenty of other blokes I can see on that page here. Brent Guerrero. Yeah, he goes all right. I'll, I'll have him in first. Look at that. Do you reckon he get offended at that? He says he picks up heaps of cheap kids. Oh, he does. Great. He does. 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 He that 40, 40 money, I think. Yeah. It's not bad. Mm. It's not bad. Unbelievable. Now, your name is a, a midfield and a back. You can get you in both areas. Uh, I'm playing forward this year. Are you going to go forward? <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, no, I'm going to try to float more. I'm going to pick you up as a back, hoping that you sort of drift up into the mid. Yeah, I asked Clark off and can try and play mid, but not man up anyone. Yeah. Just float, float free. So. Beautiful. <laughs> That's the way to do it. You had 20 goals last year. No, I missed Brunel. 20 goals? When did you move into the back line? Uh, round 15, I think. Big kick, Roy. He's a big kick. <laughs> 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 a few barrels. Well, those two ones later in the game, we just run four times. Yeah, yeah, I like that. that. That's what you oh, need right. to get well, sometimes, just to get two score points. over 100. Yeah, that sneaky goal. He's my captain. Anyway. Oh, yeah. Lock now, it in. Lock ben Carson, did you get a hit on? Did you pick him up? Yeah. Um, I guess we'll see if he's playing, I guess. See if he does in the pre season. Mm. Go from there, but, um, yeah. But he's worth a bit of coin. Well, he? Uncontested, I might add. It doesn't matter, it's all right. 
still can. Yeah, exactly. It's <laughs> one last question before we roll. Um, we can't watch the game of yours a while back. I can't remember who you were playing, but there's a couple of fat guys, right? And they're standing on the fence and they were yelling out, they kicked it to Stuart Jew and he dropped it, right? And he yelled out, You can't do that if it was a chicken! <laughs> what does that mean? I would have a clue. Well, actually, you've heard some of the catch it with a pie. <laughs> <laughs> what right, I, I don't understand that. Yeah. What's that? Well, I don't understand. Well, they say that. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm not too sure. <laughs> no. Do you understand that? No, I don't I'm get it. No. I don't <laughs> get it. I'll have a guess with that. Actually, I've got one last question to wrap up. Um, last time we were talking to you, we gave you a DT Talk t-shirt, oh, yeah. which yep. you obviously loved it, we could tell by your facial expression. Yep. Um, what have you been doing with it? Have you been wearing I actually, it? I actually framed it with the stubby already over, it's up on my wall. Right? Oh, seriously? Yeah, yeah nah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Good on you, Hodge. Oh. Thank you very much, mate. Good luck this year. Yeah, thanks, guys. And uh, thanks, mate. best of luck in Dream Team. Good luck, mate. Yeah, I'll be my back on. See you next time we're doing it. Right, awesome, thanks, mate. Cool. See you guys. Righto, thanks, Hodge. Oh, He's the face legend. of football this year, that place. That was Goodbye. awesome to get him uh, so early in the season. Well, he sent in, he sent in a photo of the uh, <laughs> DT Talk Top that he said he uh, framed up. <laughs> As you can see there, he's done a bloody great Luke job. Well done, Luke. You're a champion. That's <laughs> awesome. Okay, so we've obviously had a couple of weeks to have a good look at uh, the prices of everyone and so forth. What I might do, because everyone loves a hot tip, I might go around and get um, different players, different positions. So I might get you to pick a back for us, Bob. Oh, well, the first bloke I locked in was Chad Corns because of his price. A little bit cheaper, and we know that he's going to be back. And if he's not locked into your back line, well, then you're not going to win. I was hoping Bob would miss that one. Right. You're not going to win. I'll get you to pick a forward, man. Uh, I'm going to go uh, Dildo, Brett Delidio. He uh, ripped 07. <laughs> oh, wait, you, <laughs> you are hung up. I'm just trying to remember that. He, he ripped it to shreds last year, and he's got to be a lock in, I reckon. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'll pick a centre. I think Daniel Rich. He's one of the few rookies that I think we can yeah. really guarantee will get a run. So I'll lock him into the midfield. Um, a ruck, oh. I think we all know everyone wants a big Cox. Big Cox, oh, yeah. Yeah, it's silly not to have a big one. Cox um, you do. Yeah, so, um, Coxie, lock for me. All day. All, all day, day. yeah. Big I think Cox. everyone's got to have Cox. I think we all got a bit crappy with that last year. Yeah, yeah. Not, having, sure. a, not having the... I had a big Cox. I had one the whole time. I've had one a long time. I had Hamish McIntosh, and then I had Jeff White, and then... Yeah, I was crappy. Yeah, that's so bad. Sweet. Okay, um... A Ruffy. I want everyone to pick a Ruffy. Doesn't matter what position. Hit me with one. All right, I'm back. On board. JB. Jared Brennan. <laughs> Jared <laughs> Brennan. Don't Not do it. again. <laughs> I love him. And then I hate him, but I love him. There's like a little roller coaster ride there uh, with him. Wrong answer. But he's going to have a good year this year. No, he won't. <laughs> he's going to have a good year. He'll have like a good first two rounds like he does every year. And everyone will pick on Get him up and then like just on him. <laughs> you got I can't that. talk. But hey, uh, I'm going to go... someone not to pick up. Uh, well, last year, my roughie was um, Nathan Jones. <laughs> so I've lost a lot of credibility in, in my rough. But um, I'm going to go with uh, Chris Maston or Mason, however you say it, from West Coast. I reckon he's, he's going to get there, I reckon. He's right, going to have a good run. Um, Paul Hayes will be coming back for the Dockers. He's, he's, he's at a good price. He'll average more than that, I reckon. Yep. Apparently, he's got his head screwed on this year as well. Oh, so. well that helps. So, so. Yeah, so... Is that it? Right, guys. Good luck with it. See you in a few weeks. See ya. And um, yeah, so that sounds good. Retard. You're in bed. I didn't want to do it too.